Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kari and today I thought we'd do something a little bit different I thought I would take you out into Paris with me to run a few errands Just kind of spend the day together as you can tell I'm already in the 18th district I'm right in front of the Sacre Coeur as you can see and I'm over here because I need to go to the garment district And the garment district is right next to the Sacre Coeur because I need to pick up some fabric Because if you watch my literary fiction girly reads manga for the first time vlog You'll know that I went to Japan Expo here in Paris last July and at the end of it I was like next year. I'm definitely going to try to do a cosplay so I'm already starting to think about what cosplay I want to do in July and I've decided that one I'm definitely going to do the expo is four days so one of the days I'm definitely going to cosplay Wicked Lady or Black Lady from Sailor Moon if you're familiar so I'm here to pick up some fabric to make that cosplay and this is just the best area to buy fabric here in Paris so I thought I would take you along for that but that's just one of the many things that I need to do today and I thought that I could take you around and spend a day together here in Paris so if that sounds interesting to you stick around make sure you hit the like button if this is something that you're into if you're interested in me making more vlog style videos i would definitely love to hear from you about that what types of things would you be interested in seeing around here in paris definitely let me know so like i said let's spend the day together here in paris greater success than I thought it was going to be. I found exactly what I wanted, like exactly the type of fabric, exactly the color that I wanted. It could not have gone better. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. So now I'm going to go look for some of the little rhinestones that need to go around the neck and around the wrists. Let's go.
if you're ever in Paris and you want to get some fabric because you like to make stuff, you like to sew things, whatever, make sure you hit up the Marché Saint-Pierre, the Dreyfus location. And just on the other corner, you can find uh, somewhere here you can see that it's a uh, pen fabrics. So these two stores, they're right on the same corner of each other. Definitely hit these two places up when next time you're in Paris. I forgot to say that there are a bunch of other fabric stores around the area because it is the garment district, like I said, so there's lots of other like cheap uh, locations. But those two places that I just talked about are the best places to go. I would highly recommend them. They have the best selection, the best quality of fabrics. Just be ready to deal with the crowd because <laughs> there's so many people in this neighborhood, so many tourists, so just come prepared. There's a bunch of construction getting ready for the Olympics. Uh, but first we're going to go to Smith and & Son and then we'll probably pop over to Galignani because it's a two minute walk down the street. So let's go see if there's anything good at the bookstore today. Are you hearing my words? I'm saying to you Cause I'm looking in your eyes You're looking past mine that I'm just trying bunch of prize books for the Women's Prize and the International Booker Prize and nothing there really spoke to me that I need to prioritize that over these prize books so I didn't get anything although I was tempted by the Funfetti cake batter that's something that's really hard to get here and 
I was tempted, but I think I'll get it next time because they didn't have the matching icing. If you know, you know. Uh, if they would have had the icing, I would have got it 100%. Uh, but now I'm walking to Galignani to see if they have anything that could tempt me. anything that tempted me although I did decide that Kairos I don't remember who the author is but the book that was long listed for the international booker I decided that if it's shortlisted I'm definitely going to read it because it tempts me I want to read it I'm interested in it but I feel like the plot is kind of parallel like similar to trespasses that was shortlisted for the women's prize for fiction last year and I got tricked I was bamboozled by trespasses last year and I don't want that to happen again with Kairos although between you and me, I trust the international booker way more than I trust the Women's Prize for Fiction. But if that book is longlisted, or excuse me, if it was shortlisted, I'm going to read it. Um, if you've read Kairos already, I would love to know if the interpersonal relationship is the main point of the story or if the political stuff that's happening is the main story. Definitely let me know because I'm more into the interpersonal and less about the political side of it. I mean, if the political stuff is happening alongside at the same time as the personal, that's totally fine, but I want the main focus to be on the personal part of the story. So if you've read Kairos, let me know. here to Hey Publik and maybe it's a little bit loud because there's a lot of things happening right now. Uh, I came over here because I'm going to go to a shop called Manga Story because they sell manga, anime figures, all different kinds of things and I thought it would be fun to stop over there see what fun things they have. Hopefully something Sailor Moon. Uh, let's go check it out. I'm 
but it's super loud over here. I don't know what's happening. There's like a protest. There's a bunch of people making noise on motorcycles and everything. But anyway, as you can see, I just went to Manga Story and I got the last Cosmic Heart Compact Proplica that they had. I'm so excited. I've had my eye on it for a really long time. But uh, yeah, I'm really excited to add it to my nerdy Sailor Moon collection of stuff. So I'm not sure what we're going to do next. You'll find out when I do. So if you're into anime and manga and everything, I would definitely recommend coming over here to the Raipu Greek area because there's tons of manga and anime shops uh, to buy figurines, manga, whatever. Of course, the manga is in French though, but it's really fun to see the different editions that they have for French. Um, so yeah, I would definitely recommend if you're into manga and anime. I think that that's going to do it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Let me know if you did. What else would you like to see in future Paris vlogs? I would love to know. I hope you had a good time running around Paris with me, doing a few errands, having a little bookish day. Don't forget, if you like this video, please give it a like. I would really, really appreciate it. And subscribe if you haven't already. I would love to have you back for future little adventures out in Paris. And I'll talk to you again next time. Bye!